Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's vlog, video, whatever you want to call it, um, I'm going to do a grocery haul. I'm going to show you here everything I got in a little bit. Um, uh, this is the first grocery haul, grocery, like real grocery shopping I've done in like two months. Because as I've said before, my husband did switch his job a couple of times and uh, it just made things a little tight. So we haven't really been grocery shopping. We've been skimping around so right now my cupboard my refrigerator my freezer pretty much empty like my refrigerator would be be empty besides condiments if i actually cleaned it out so i went to aldi today and i went to pick and save which if you don't have pick and save by you our pick and save is owned by kroger so i'm assuming they're pretty much the same thing um, I did, between the two stores, I did spend about $140, um, I was budgeting for like $200, but I did put a lot of stuff back because we still are at like, we're just starting to get over that hump of financial stump, so I am still trying to save a little bit, so I did put a bunch of stuff back, but I did also add some stuff to the cart that we didn't necessarily need. So yeah, uh, I'm sorry if the dogs are making a lot of noise. They've been in the kennel all morning because I wanted to hurry up and go grocery shop because I do have to work tonight. I did pick up a shift. So I'm going to go ahead and take you through what I got. I have my whole table full and I have a box on the floor that I have to go through. So yeah. Alright, so this is the view from the table. Like I said, I have this isn't all of it. I do have a box on the floor that I, now I have covered up because I can't fit it all on the table. So I have it covered up so that the dogs don't get it. But I will do this stuff and then I will... Hold on. We're playing tug of war. Lacey and Wendy, other room, come on. Other room, go. 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 She's like, no, I want to be by you. Anyways, so I don't even know where to start, honestly. Um, it's just going to be a mixture. I'll try to explain what's from what, but... This is my daily life. Alright, so on this side, hold on, let me get a different angle. I got paper towel because when you have three dogs, paper towel is a necessity. Like, so I just get the cheap kind just because we go through it so quick. I got this French vanilla creamer. This is from Aldi's. It costs like a dollar seventy-four, I think. Um, I go through creamer a lot now that I make my own iced coffee, which is something I started to do when. I had to start be careful with how I spend my money. Uh, if you watched my last video, I explained how I make my iced coffee in that. But so I just went with the cheaper kind. I got red grapes and I got green grapes. I got these waters at all these. I got strawberry and I got white grape. Um, there's a water from Walmart. It's like Clearview, Clear Water, something like that that I used to get. But they stopped making the strawberry kiwi or kiwi strawberry kind. So I've been struggling to find a water that I like because that was my favorite. So I'm just trying these out. I also picked up a couple of Powerades from Pick and Save. Uh, these are, were 88 cents. So I've got the four blues for Frank, three purples for me. Got to get on the milk because we drink milk, obviously. I just got some cheese dip because I've been craving broccoli with cheese, except for I did not get any broccoli, but I figured I could put this in my cupboard for the next time I'm craving it. I got a couple bags of chips from Aldi because they're super cheap. I believe they're like 97 cents. So I got some sour cream and cheddar. I got some nacho, which is, these are just like uh, Doritos. I got barbecue. And then I got some, some regular corn chips. Okay, let's see what else. I got a off-brand of Parmesan cheese from Pick and Save. Um, something tells me my husband did not like... Okay, my husband goes through Parmesan like no other. He puts on everything. And he told me I did not have to eat the craft. But something tells me he did not like this kind when I got the last time. But we'll see. It was either this or the craft, so... I got the blue Hawaiian punch. The other day I did get the red, and apparently Frank don't like the red, which, all right. But he said he liked the blue, so I got that. We're trying not to drink soda, so like I said, I'm getting alternatives. 
Uh, okay, let's, what else? I got a thing of potatoes, like real potatoes, because I'm trying to make more homemade foods, and they were really cheap at Aldi's. This celery was 97 cents at Aldi's. I got some Colby Jack shredded cheese. I got honey smoked ham for sandwiches and stuff. These monsters, as you guys know, or if you don't know, if you don't watch my Instagram stories, I'm obsessed with these white monsters. And Pick and Save had them on sale to buy two, get one free. So I picked up three of those. I do have a ice pound of ice cream down there. Sorry if this is all, it's just one big pile. I'm hoping I'm getting everything. I got sticks of butter that I'm going to just shove in my freezer. Uh, garlic toast for when we have spaghetti. I like to buy these egg noodles because if you don't know, I do work second shift. So I work 2 to 10. And after my shift, I'm normally hungry. And these are super easy to make and just, you can add seasonings or whatever to them. I bought smoked sausage. I figured these would go good with some potatoes. I'm trying to broaden my horizons on meals to make because we always eat the same mac and cheese, hamburger helper, like the easy things to make. So I'm trying to broaden my horizon and make different kinds of meals. I got some cordon blues because my husband loves those. Um, I did get two boxes of hamburger helper, double cheese burger macaroni, and four cheese lasagna. This is just... For when I don't know what to make. Some waffles. Tortilla shells for tacos. We are big taco people. I got a big thing of cheeses because it was on sale. I've been craving Triscuits for some god awful reason. So I got the garlic and onion one. I figured that'd be a good snack for work. Um, I'm going to try these Johnsonville cheddar and bacon burgers uh we'll see if we like these normally i just get beef burgers but these ones are only premium cuts of pork so we'll see about that we got some salisbury steak we love this this is a good quick easy meal to make red baron pizza was actually on sale it's normally like 526 it was on sale for a dollar 99 so i definitely picked up three of those um I got some Parmesan goldfish for Frank. As you notice, I did get a lot of snacky foods, but we are snacky people. Um, I just bought, what, what brand is this? The Kroger Premium Brand for coffee. This is how I make my iced coffee. I have been making it with the, what's the brand? Folgers, I think. But this was a lot cheaper than that, so I figured why not give this a try. I'm not picky on my coffee, Frankie is. I got the Kroger chocolate chip cookies. And then the dogs go at it again. All right, now that we made a complete circle. I've got a couple of pesticides. I feel like I say pesticides. I got the butter and herb and the Parmesan. Those are good for Frank's lunches when he comes home. I got a small tiny thing of pepperoni. I figured this would be a good like little snack. Um, I got three pounds of ground beef. It was on sale for $9.38, which normally it would have been uh, 12 something. So that's that. And then I got some, hold on. I only have two hands here. This is a Johnsonville. Yeah, Johnsonville beer brats and cheddar brats. Because those were two for seven or two for five, something like that. So, yeah, let me clear this off and I'll show you what they got in the box. All right, real quick for round two. This, all this stuff is definitely from Aldi's. So, I got some more maple and brown sugar oatmeal. I'm the only one that eats that. So, I got some chocolate chip granola bars and peanut butter chocolate chip granola bars. Frankie likes these for when he has to rush in the morning and put something in his stomach. Just a brick of Colby Jack cheese. I got two cans of tuna. Frankie enjoys tuna salad because he's just, that's gross. So those are for when he has to make himself a meal. I got a thing of garlic powder because at all these, these are like 95 cents I think. And I need garlic powder. Um, a big tub of butter. Got Frankie some peanut butter wafers. 
some Swiss rolls because he likes his desserts. Some sliced cheese, sour cream. I got some cheap hot dogs. Um, I got these water lemonade water sticks because I like to drink a lot of water, but I can't drink plain water. And at work, it's at work is when I get most of my water in because I'm just running around and I'm hot and I'm sweaty. So I am a big lemonade person. So I enjoy that. And I have like this big Yeti cup that I put one of those in. I got some mashed potatoes. Uh, we I don't know if we've tried this brand from Aldi's, but I figured one of these of each would be nice. I got some Pop-Tarts, again, for when Frank's in a rush. And then last but not least, I've got three boxes of the Cheese Club macaroni. We are trying to go off-brand with our macaroni. Macaroni is one thing that I normally go brand with, with and buy craft, but we're going to try because I've heard that all macaroni is the same, just with different labels. So, so that is my grocery haul after going two months without buying groceries, really. So, I'm hoping this will last us quite a while, at least until our next payday, if not longer. Um, I'm definitely trying to think of more... Sorry. I'm now that we've gone through this whole not being able to go grocery shopping experience, I'm trying to think of more frugal meals to make that are cheaper so if you guys have any ideas put them down in the comments below we're not big like we do have a lot of rice but i don't really cook but we don't eat beans so i know rice and beans are a big cheap one but yeah leave me below your cheap meal ideas and i will definitely try them out uh, i hope you guys like this video uh if you're new here subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video Bye, guys.